today Pass the time away Writing the letters In the same How you laugh While I cry Each time I saw the time Take all the letters In the same Just talking about any cat, I'm talking about a cat with catitude. You know what I mean? Like he owns the place and he's just doing you a big favor by letting you live there. Yeah. Well, this is a song that my cat Rusty and I wrote together. Well, he wrote the words. He's really not much of a musician, but so you have to listen to the song and imagine it's being sung by a cat. It's a cat singing to you. It's from a cat's perspective, okay? Rusty is no longer with me, but I made him the promise I would always perform this song in the style of his favorite guitar player, Chet Catkins. Yeah, Rusty liked old Chet because he didn't use a flat pick, he used his claws. It's called I'm a Cat. You tell me, stay off the table, get off the counter, you humans can be such a pest. You're here to serve me. You don't even deserve me. Don't forget, it's my house, you're the guest. I'll lay on your neck and you say, no, don't, I'll smother. And I just blow you off because you ain't my real mother. I'll get my drink from the sink because I don't care what you think. That's how it is. I'm a cat. Say 
say I'm disgusted. I need a good brushing. Oh, you stepped on a hairball. So what? Don't rub my belly and do not touch my tail. You may stroke my neck down to my butt. You like to say dogs are smarter than cats are, but we don't pull sleds, sniff for bombs, or go chase cars and dogs. They have masters, but us cats, we got staff. That's how it is. I'm a cat. Yeah, that's right. I'm a cat. And you're not. So, suffer in your irrelevance. Whatever you do, don't ever forget. The first word in meow is me. That's a cat. Thank you, cat lovers everywhere. Are you ready to sing for us? Okay. We call ourselves Blackmore McLean because those are our names. We've been around a long time. We've both worked on the Grand Ole Opry, uh, picking up popcorn boxes mostly, but we were there. Um, that's right. Throwing the drunks out, that's what we did there. That's right, whatever he said. That's true. <laughs> it's true. So let's dazzle him with this. Will we make it through the night? Written and composed by Chris Christopherson. Chris Christopherson. That's right. Famous in 1970, Sammy Smith. Done by me, 1998. At the Opry. I'm going to do it here. You were like 12 years old when you played the Opry, huh? Oh, I was barely out of there. Okay.
I do. I think we should yeah. do that. Yeah. Porter Wagner, Dolly Parton. Biggest duet they ever had, 1970. It's an old Tom Paxton song. Anybody know which one it was? Anybody, anybody. Anybody, anybody. Porter and Dolly's first duet. Tom Paxton wrote it. The winner gets a uh, free round of our regards. Hey, thank you. Can I take this? It's called The Last Thing on My Mind, 1970. I'm going to do Porter's part, okay? All right, just this one time. Yeah. You, uh, well, you do the best you can, okay? You just give it all you got. Okay. Just, just put it all out there. All right. Okay. Just Fine. don't hold nothing back. Fine. But hey, moms buy booze, you know? They spend money. Yeah? 1969. Written and recorded by the day. Of course. And now we're gonna do it. Silver Things. Silver Silver Things in 1969. Silver Things.
you the oldest song we do. The show is Music and Memory, so we're digging back to 1893 for this one. It's actually started out as a German march, but somehow it got Americanized as a polka. And it's northern Michigan, you can't play more than a half an hour up here without playing a polka. I think there's like an ordinance against it. song, same fellow of the road, heartaches by the number and stuff like that, but this was considered a blues song and actually uh, Ray Charles recorded this too. And the Rolling Stones, that's no kidding, Rolling the Rolling Stones, the Stones, yeah, Fred and Barney and Wilma and Betty, even Dino got in that. Roll, 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 roll. Let's see here. That's it. Should I fuzz it up? Yeah? I'm kind of liking that. Two and a one, two, three, yeah. My bills are all due, and my baby needs shoes, but I'm busted. Cutting this down to a quarter of a pound, and I'm busted. I got a cow that went dry and a hen that won't lay A big stack of bills in the dinner every day The cow is gonna haul my belongings away cause I'm busted I went to my brother just to ask for a loan, I was busted He said, I hate you big like a dog for a loan, but I'm busted my brother said, there ain't a thing I can do My wife and my kids, they're all down with the flu And I was just thinking about calling on you Cause I'm much dead
I am the thief, but a man can go wrong when he's busted. The boozer began, that summer is gone, and I'm busted. The fields are all bare, and the cotton won't grow. Me and my family got the pack up and go. I'll, I'll make a bit, well, I don't know, cause I'm busted. I'm busted. Well, we do some Michigan songs, and here's another Michigan tune. I stole this off a Johnny Cash album about 1972. And it was the flip side of one of his songs. It was considered a B-side. It talks about wandering around on the shores of Lake Michigan with only a dollar in your pocket. And torn between whether that's a dollar too much or a dollar that ain't enough. It could be either thing. That's right. dollar bill.